Welcome to a tutorial on Violin Designer. In this video, I will show you how to create a basic design, how the designer UI works, add some components, and then connect the whole thing on the Java side. So I've imported a starter here, and I'm just going to go ahead and create a new design, call it example design. And I'm also going to create a Java companion file uh, that allows us to integrate the design on the Java side later on. So this is the designer UI. This is the viewport that shows the components you add and allows you to drag and drop them. And this is the palette that shows the components that you have in your project, as well as some useful snippets. So I'm going to go ahead and search for a vertical layout. I'm just going to add that. And then add a text field like so. And then I think I want a button as well. So I can drag stuff here in the outline that shows the structure of the design. Next, I want to edit the properties. So I select the components and then I can add them or edit them here in the properties panel. So I'll just edit some values here, add, make that a submit button and then call this name and remove the placeholder. All right, looks good. Next, I want to tie this button on the Java side and access it and add some logic. So what I do is I click this button here and this uh, creates the field into the Java side and I can go to the Java class through this button here. So this is the button from the design and now we're on the Java side and this is just a normal Vardin, Vardin um, component. So I can do Vardin button, add click listener and take that event. But actually, I'd like to access the text field as well and show its contents. So I'm going to go back quickly, connect that as well. So now we have the name text field here. And I'm just going to call it get value and maybe show that in a notification. All right, that's it. And then I just add the whole design into my main view. And again, just basic body Java stuff. Lastly, I just run run Jetty uh, from the Maven targets and then access the page through localhost 8080. I should see my design here. All right, looks good. And then let's see if the logic works as well. Hello tutorial, awesome. Thank you for watching.